Hello guys and welcome to Till Vacuum Do Us Part. I woke up to a very rainy day and I feel like those are the best days for cleaning when you're stuck inside, there's rain outdoors. I don't know, rain's very calming and relaxing to me. I'm gonna show you up on the screen throughout the video. Um, I am watching the news just to make sure it's not getting bad because we do have like some tornado watches and warnings going on in our area. So I'm just gonna keep that on so I know what's happening, but I'm gonna keep cleaning this whole time just so I can get this whole kitchen taken care of. It's one spot I haven't really cleaned for spring cleaning and I love to give my kitchen a deep clean. Now we haven't been here a full year yet so it's not terrible but there's no reason to let it get terrible before I clean it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a deep clean and get it nice and fresh. It will be alright if you now I'm gonna go ahead and get my candle lit. I used to always light my candles at the end of cleaning and I'm not sure why. Now I've been doing it at the beginning and it's just so much better. So if you're not lighting it at the beginning, it's just such a simple thing you can switch up, try it and see what you think. And I also wanna thank Walmart for sponsoring today's video. I placed a huge order with them and got some really cool products I wanna share with you guys. I promise you we are gonna get to cleaning here in a moment. I just wanted to show you like the vibe in the house. I feel like cleaning when it's raining outside is just so calming. Even the boys are relaxed. <laughs> Savannah's relaxing in her room. I don't know, I just love cozy rainy days. But the first place I'm gonna start is the stove. It's probably my least favorite thing to clean in this house. Like there's a lot of things I don't enjoy cleaning but I just like despise cleaning the stove. So I wanna go ahead and just get that started so everything can be soaking and then I can get it marked off the list and then I can just enjoy cleaning the rest of the kitchen. Like I mentioned earlier, today's video is sponsored by Walmart. Man, they are killing it. The things I get on Walmart is insane, and I love that I can just order it from my bed or Savannah's dance class or in the car and have it shipped straight to my front door. You can also do like a pickup order, whatever works best for your family, but I just feel like it's so convenient. Now, I've been talking about their fashion a lot over on Instagram because they're killing it there, but when it comes to like the home, so like home decor, cleaning, organizing, there are two brands that like would Whatever they come out with, I have to buy it immediately. And one of those is the Home Edit. You guys know we all love their organizers. I have them in every single closet and drawer in my house and have zero complaints. But they also came out with this cleaning line and have amazing like brushes and brooms and they're perfect for your sinks or showers. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these set up, but I just feel like they're gorgeous. Plus I'm in this like get the color out of my house era and anything that I can remove the color from, I'm doing it. I just love neutrals that much. Just like some of you like love color, I love neutrals. And what's so funny is like the home edits known for like the rainbow, but I love that they're doing these like white with the light um, wood on them. It just goes with my house perfectly. And I feel like it just doesn't take away from the other things in your house. So even if you love color, it's just gonna be very pretty and very bold sitting there next to your sink, but it's not gonna take away from anything. So this first little brush, I'm just putting in some white vinegar and Dawn. That is like the magical solution for cleaning things. So you could keep this in your shower, your bathtub, your sink, wherever you need to scrub, like even in your bathrooms and stuff like that, it's amazing. So if you haven't tried that combination, try it, but this is like the perfect brush for it. Plus they also have more of like the rough bristle brush. So I feel like you need both and they come with replacements, which is so nice. So I went ahead and grabbed them so I could get them organized underneath my sink. And when I have them, they're ready to go. 
I think we know Walmart's just really good on prices, but I think what's shocking me is the quality just keeps getting better and better and better. And that's just what's amazing. Like I'm buying these products that look and feel so high end and function so well, but they're so affordable so anybody can have them. And that's what I love. I love finding a good deal. Here's underneath my sink. These are all the home edit organizers. I absolutely love them. There's their new brushes down there. So they're ready to go when I need them. Um, I'm gonna show these knives a little bit later on. This is just a little sneak peek of the clip, but I picked up their knives as well. I've had this same set for several years and it was time just to go ahead and refresh them since it's springtime, but they got even better. Like now the blade part is white, so they're so dreamy. But I do wanna thank Walmart again for sponsoring today's video. If you haven't checked them out in a while, do it. I'm gonna have their link down below in my description box. I'm telling you, you're gonna love everything they have out right now, especially if it's home related. Now it's back to the stove. So I'm trying to clean off the top of the stove while all the like grates are in um, the sink, just soaking and getting soft so I don't have to scrub as much. I will say I just put like hot water in there. Um, you could do like Dawn dish soap. Sometimes I put um, dishwasher pods in there. That's what I did this time. Now this sink isn't stainless steel like my other one. So that's why I put that towel down in the earlier. I don't think I mentioned that in the sink. I just don't want it to scratch my new sink. So I laid down a hand towel and then put like all the grates on it and then I'm letting it soak and then I'll scrub them, let them air dry and we'll put them back on here. But now I'm just going to make sure all the crumbs and food and all of that's off the um, top of this. And then I'm going to go ahead and clean my backsplash while I'm right there too. I'm telling you, this stove took longer to clean than like cleaning the rest of my entire kitchen. I think that's why I don't like doing it. I know when I start it, it's gonna be like a whole thing. Now, obviously I don't clean it this well often. I'll just like take them off, clean underneath it and put like the grates back on. But like when you have to do a deep clean, I don't know if there's a better way, let me know down below in the comments section. Let us all know because I feel like this just takes so long. So here's a little update outside. It is pouring. Like it's pouring even more than what it looks like on camera. Um, so I love it. But like I said, I kept keeping an eye on the weather because it's we're in Oklahoma. You just never know. So I am going to warn you. I'm about to um, let you hear the rain. So it might get a little loud.
Earlier, I mentioned there was two brands from Walmart that I like absolutely love. Like if they release something new, I have to get it ordered. And so we talked all about the home edit, but the other one is the beautiful line by Drew Barrymore. It is gorgeous. It is so high end. It is so stinking affordable. It's not even funny. Um, and so I love it. I have basically everything she's created in white. If I don't, it's because it's sold out and I can't find it not sold out. But she did come out with this new like beige tan color. It is gorgeous. It makes me want to rethink all my white appliances, but I already have so many. But if I were to switch, it would be to that color because I think it'd be so pretty with our light backsplash. We have that same color back there. If you kind of look, it's it's hard to tell in the lighting, but I feel like it would kind of bring a little bit of warmth, but I just have to convince Chase into letting me rebuy every appliance we have. Easiest way to keep your sink clean is grab this brush, put that Dawn and vinegar in it. It's like half and half. Do the soap first, otherwise the vinegar will run out. And then you can just leave it in your sink. You can lay it underneath your sink. You just press the little button, it squeezes out. I'm telling you, it cleans things so nice. So put it in your showers. That way when you're in the shower, you can just clean while you're in there. Put it in your kitchen sink, your bathroom sinks. Put it in your kids' bathrooms. I promise you, things will stay so much cleaner if you have those in your life. The clock keeps ticking. I don't know what I should do. And I wish you would be right here with me. My mind is filled with pictures of when we used to dance, but now I don't know where you are. I miss you so bad, won't you come back to me? I've got you in my head, you're all that I see. I've lost all my chances, I know that I am too late. I'm thinking of you, I'm thinking of you. Thinking of you Wondering if you're thinking about me too Now it's too late Now it's too late I'm out of time But I'm still Thinking of you My heart keeps on bleeding I have scars, the ones that healing They're all there because of you you so bad won't you come back to me i've got you in my head you're all that i see i've lost all my chances i know that i am too late i'm thinking of you i'm thinking of you i'm thinking of you I really have taken a lot of decor out of my kitchen. I feel like when I first started YouTube and like that whole life, I had very little out of my cabinets and I loved it. And then recently when we moved into this house, I felt like I just kept adding and adding and I'm not sure why. Um, and then Savannah one day was like, we need to pull some of this out. And I was like, okay, let's try it. And we pulled it out and I loved it. To be honest, I would take everything out if I could, but then it looks like no one lives here. But I did want to show you this knife set up close because it's beautiful. It's so pretty, get it, it's beautiful. I love that that's the brand, um, but it's so beautiful. You can leave it out if you want to. If you're that type of person, this is one of those things. It can be left out and it's gorgeous. I'm also gonna show you how I use the home edit bins and keep them in a drawer um, towards the end. So don't click off. It's gonna look like the video is wrapping up, but it's not. Um, it's a little tease, I guess, but definitely stay tuned if you wanna see that.
am always on the hunt for a good broom that looks good, like neutral, nothing crazy, but still works well. And I feel like I always have a little bit of a trouble. So the one I've been using forever, like as long as I can remember is a zebra broom, cause at least it was black and white. So when I found this one, I literally screamed when I saw it on my phone and Chase was like, what? And I was like, they have the home edit broom and it's white and gray. And so I ordered that thing so fast, which is nice. I don't use my broom like all the time. Like it's not something I use every single day, but when you need it to like get underneath the sofa or like underneath the fridge, I don't know. I just feel like you can get in those creases a little bit better. And since it's been springtime, like we have a lot of dead grass. It's slowly coming back, but George rolls around in it. He comes in, there's like dead grass everywhere. So it's just nice. I can get like all those nooks and crannies and get it clean. Now I'm gonna start putting everything back in its home that I'm going to. So I'm putting the soap out, the candle. I wanted to show you a close up of the knife set. I don't think I did that earlier, but it really is pretty and just looks really classic out. Um, another thing I picked up on Walmart was this coffee maker. I do not drink coffee, but Chase and Savannah do and they love this coffee maker. So if you're in the market, um, I'm gonna have it linked down below with all the other products that I mentioned in today's video, but I just love that it was a gold. So I felt like it was a win-win. I'm just showing you right now how the house is looking. The video is not done yet, so don't click off yet, but I just wanted to show you kind of just where we are. The weather channel's still on. It's getting a little bit sunnier outside, but the kitchen is looking cleaner. Look into my eyes. I can show you what I have to say. If you still can't decide. If you still think I'm lying I will let you walk away If my eyes can't convince you That I'm still in love Since you first took my hand on that sweet Now I want to show you what the knives look like if you use the home edit organizers. And they do have like a silverware drawer set. I use them everywhere. I use them in the kitchen, obviously, but I use them like in desk drawers, bathroom drawers. I don't know, they're just perfect and come with so many different sizes. Um, so I'll have that linked as well, but I'm gonna put them away in here just so if you don't like things on your countertop, you can see what they look like in a drawer or say you don't have a lot of drawer space, then being out on the counter works just fine too. I just wanted you to see both options. If I can get through, get through to you Your eyes keep wandering away If you made up your mind To leave this behind Then I can't force you to stay If my and here are all the dirty towels just from cleaning the kitchen. So I'm gonna go ahead and get those thrown in the washer. Here 
here's one final look at the kitchen. It looks so good, but it felt even better. And then here's one last look outside. I kid you not, when I was done cleaning, it finished raining. So it was like perfect. We got to enjoy the day. It got sunny outside. I did mention earlier that I'm like getting the color out of my house era. I'm curious what era you're in. Is it like organizing, cleaning? Is it something with your kids? Like whatever it is, comment down below. And I do want to thank Walmart again for sponsoring today's video. Everything I mentioned is going to be down below in my description box. So definitely check that out. But thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you have a wonderful week and I will see you in the next one. Bye.